financial assistance for the completion of the six water Viewfort water supply redevelopment project through a CDB loan has been approved by Parliament. The Caribbean Development Bank has made an additional $7,378,000 available for the venture. This consists of an amount of $4,178,000 from its equity and market resources and $3,200,000 that the CDB allocated from the European Investment Bank under the Climate Change Action Line of Credit. Minister of Agriculture, Fisheries, Physical Planning, Natural Resources and Cooperatives, Honorable Ezekiel Joseph, listed the components of this second phase of the project at the recent sitting of Parliament. We are going to rehabilitate the raw water treatment line at Boseju, the construction of a new water treatment plant at Boseju with a capacity of 8,640 cubic meters, the construction of a new chemical storage building at Boseju, the installation of approximately 8.7 kilometers of HDP, HDP that's a new line, a new um, pipeline speaker that we are now using, and a DI transmission main from Boseju water treatment plant to Binfield and Latuni. Honorable Joseph says the project is not limited to just the Viewfort North area. The installation of, of an additional 5 kilometers of HDPE and DI transmission main from Ojetan to Labi. So, right, Mr. Speaker, we're looking at Viewfort North, Viewfort South, and Labi. Now, if you are a vindictive government, will we do that? These are not seats that we have won. But we feel it's important, Mr. Speaker, we feel it's important to take care of every St. Lucian. The proposed project also consists of infrastructure works comprising two river intake structures, three new pumping stations, 15 kilometers of new high-density polyethylene transmission mains, and three new storage reservoirs.